Wow. Yeah. Well, so um, we've got some decent weather, you Good. know, uh, coming our Not way bad. this week. We've got a couple of showers, a couple of thunderstorms around the next couple of days. But other than that, we're in, we're in this great stretch of weather, which started over the weekend. That was glorious. Hope you had a great one. Already nice and bright out there. Sun is up. Uh, not much cloud cover across Maine, but there is some in New Hampshire. There's actually a fading line of storms. They were more formidable as they were back in the Adirondacks. They passed over Vermont and they're starting to fall apart, except down around Keene and uh, Brattleboro, New Hampshire right now. Uh, Brattleboro, Vermont, I should say. Uh, as they continue to trek across the Granite State, they'll likely continue to fizzle. And we'll only end up with a few drops out of them in western Maine late this morning. State this morning is 55 to 60, so it's nice and comfortable, except in Caribou, where it's 49. By the way, Caribou's going to be the hot spot today. We're going to hit like 78 this afternoon. It'll be warm and sunny most of the day. Fronts back here to our west. We'll offer up our shower and storm chances. Nothing widespread. It's not going to rain all the time either. It's more scattered in nature, hit or miss stuff. Wish I could say it was going to be a solid soaking for the entire region, but it's not. Clouding up midday, we have some isolated showers. Onshore breeze starts to kick in, so we'll reach our max temperature around lunchtime. And then the numbers back off into the 60s, kind of a chilly feel to the end of the day with that strong ocean breeze. And the showers will become more widespread too, with a chance for a thunderstorm embedded in them, but nothing severe in nature. And that batch of rain will be scooting across the state during the overnight hours. So a lot of eastern and northern Maine, you'll avoid drops today. Just a 30% chance during the daylight before sunset. 60% chance for western Maine. And it's almost a guarantee that you're going to see some drops, especially during the morning for New Hampshire as that fading line of storms uh, gets across the state. Highs in Portland, just 66. That's the chilly spot today. Lewiston, Augusta, upper 60s, low 70s, Waterville, Bangor, Callis hits 75, and even warmer for Millinocket in the Central Highlands. And Arista County, as I mentioned, will be the warm spot. Uh, Caribou there at 78. Cold front passes tomorrow. Thunderstorms more of a likelihood. Could get a little gusty. We'll keep an eye on them for you. Behind that, it's beautiful. Wednesday through Friday, stunning weather for the end of the week. Loving it. Lots of sunshine and you know what? Pleasant temperatures too, 75 to 80. Seas 3 to 4. South winds gusting to 25 knots today. So a little choppy out there on the water. Bad wind direction too for a lot of us. All right, mostly cloudy skies today with scattered showers, upper 60s, mid 70s tomorrow with some afternoon storms. And then it's stunning Wednesday through Friday. Lots of sunshine out there, 75 to 80 degrees. Humidity levels in check too. Over the weekend, maybe a storm Saturday afternoon. Most of the weekend rain free and most of the weekend also in the upper 70s. Love looking it. great. This yep. is June and Maine. Give the AC a break. Yes. Open up the windows. It's showing off a little bit right yeah. now, June and Maine.